In October 1940, Barrymore returned to the NBC radio network to work on Rudy Valley's show, now called The Seal Test Show. Barrymore recorded 74 episodes of the program, continuing in the vein of self-parody, with jokes about his drinking, declining career and marital issues. On May 19, 1942, while recording a line from Romeo and Juliet for the show, Barrymore collapsed. He was taken to the Hollywood Presbyterian Hospital and died there on May 29 from cirrhosis of the liver and kidney failure, complicated by pneumonia. Shortly before his death, Barrymore returned to the faith of the Catholic Church. Although Errol Flynn's memoirs claim that the film director Raoul Walsh borrowed Barrymore's body before burial to leave his corpse propped in a chair for a drunken Flynn to discover when he returned home, Jean Fowler, a close friend of Barrymore, stayed with the body all night and denies the story. Barrymore was buried at Calvary Cemetery in Los Angeles on June 2. In 1980, Barrymore's son had his father's body reinterred at Philadelphia's Mount Vernon Cemetery.